हेलो एंड वेलकम अंस अगेन ऑन माय यूट्यूब चैनल सर जीवनो डेट्स वी आर स्टडी मैथ क्लास टेंथ मैथमेटिक्स इन क्लास टेंथ मैथमेटिक्स वी स्टडी द क्वाड्रेटिक क्वेश्चंस एंड इन क्वाड्रेटिक क्वेश्चंस द थ्री मीटर्स वी आर जनरल वी हियर टू सॉल्व द क्वाड्रेटिक क्वेश्चंस फर्स्ट मीटर्स वाज फैक्टराइजेशन मीटर्स एंड सेकंड मीटर्स वाज सच सेकंड मीटर्स एंड सेकंड मीटर्स दैट वी हैव सॉल्व्ड सम बाय मींस ऑफ द टेकिंग द द methods in which involves uh, involves uh, many factors and uh, third methods that was uh, associated with um, uh, uh, associated with uh, our formula methods uh, and uh, so we have to find that we had to find out the discriminants and the different phase and the different ways uh, is if the discriminant is given the nature of the roots uh, on the basis of nature of the roots we have described here so now so today so we will discuss about the today's the to <coughs> Uh, the method to determine the value of unknown when when the nature of roots is given so here is some example with the help of example we will try to find out the nature of the roots uh, is given then find out the discriminants okay discrim uh, determines so here is the question so the first step uh, determine first we will write here determines method to determine method to determine the method to determine the value of unknown when the value of unknown when the roots are when the nature when the nature of roots is given okay nature of roots is given so this is the headings so let's start so when the what we will do is if the nature of roots is given nature of roots is given so we have to find out the value of unknown unknown means that is the given is a quadratic equation is given here so we will take these unknowns according to our uh, our viewpoints and uh, so try to solve the same questions by uh, taking that's so nature of roots nature of roots it discriminant is equal to zero if say less than the discriminant is less than zero and if discriminant is more than zero so okay so these are the uh, criteria uh, uh, criteria for knowing so to know the nature of the root so with the help of this we will try to find out the nature of the roots and sorry nature of the roots it will be given and we will solve the unknown unknown so what about the given in the equation so let's say start with first of all first we find the value of discriminant find first find the value of discriminant okay First, we will try to find out value of discriminants, and after finding discriminants in terms unknown terms, of the conditions that is, and use the conditions, use the conditions. Conditions here, if d is less than zero, if d is equal to zero, and d is sorry greater than equal to and less than zero. So three conditions on the basis of these three conditions we will determine here. So, so let's say start with some example. Here is the example. Example. We have taken examples because we have studied here and naturally we will solve the questions without taking any help. If we take the help, it will it will distort. It will disturb our minds, your minds, and everyone. So once we have learned, we have to create confidence. Whatever the unknown terms will included in this, we will remember it. Okay. So recall it. So remember this means recall this. Find value one. Okay. Here is the find the value of k this is unknown okay k is unknown find the value of k for which which the value of k for which the given equations given equations have equal roots given equations have equal roots so let's say start solutions equations is given here so first let's say
ओके सो हियर इज द के माइनस ट्वेल्व होल स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू एक्स के माइनस ट्वेल्व ओके दिस इज इक्वेशन एक्स प्लस टू सोलूशन Solutions. We know that's why it's a given. So we have, we have, so we write here. So we have. So what we have, sir? Given equations. Equations is here. K minus twelve x whole x square is equal to x. Sorry, not both sides. K k minus twelve plus two is equal to zero. Either you write here or here. No problems. Okay. So given equations is given here. So so here two, not two. फॉर्मुला Now right here is the comparing sign. So a is equal to a is here k minus twelve. B is equal to b is given here two in bracket k minus twelve and c is equal to two. C is given here plus two. Okay. So we have compare here. Now substitute this value. Seconds. Ah, uh, because it's a nature of rules is given here. Nature is this gradient is equal to zero. It's already telling guys. I have a equal rules. Equal roots means that sir, nature is given here. Equal roots. Equal roots means that sir, first d is equal to zero. Real and equal roots means that d is equal to zero. So here sir, we have sir, so find out discriminant. D is equal to you know that d is equal to b square minus four ac. Okay. So right here, b square minus four ac. So right this b square b square value is here. If if a value is b square b square is here sir two. Two in bracket k minus twelve whole square. What is k minus twelve whole square plus uh, comma and k minus twelve whole square comma c is equal to and b and minus four into a value is given here k minus twelve k minus twelve into and a c is given here. Two. What is so two is given here. So so two questions. Second questions is already given here. So so we will solve with these questions in terms. So this equal to b square minus four is a. So four we will take here common two in brackets. So we will take right here. So two. Ah, uh, b square. So b square means that two k plus twelve. Two k plus twenty four. 2k minus 24 whole square minus 4k minus 12 24 4k minus 24 48 sorry 48 into 2 8k into 96 this is equations okay this equations we find here now solve this equations here so 2k square a square b square minus 2ab 4k minus minus 96 
एटीएम फोर के माइनस फिफ्टी सिक्स के प्लस ट्वेंटी Five seventy six minus ninety six. Okay, so we will solve here fifty two k and ninety six minus seventy six is equal to discriminants. So we will find out minus. फोर के माइनस ट्वेल्व होल स्क्वायर माइनस एट के माइनस ट्वेल्व सो इट वी कैन ऑलवेज भी स्क्वायर इज गिवेन इयर सो टेक द स्क्वायर एज ए कॉमन सो इफ वी टेक द स्क्वायर एज ए कॉमन सो के माइनस ट्वेल्व एंड द फोर के माइनस ट्वेल्व माइनस एट सो इट वी कैन कॉमन सो के माइनस ट्वेल्व ओके एंड अगेन के माइनस ट्वेल्व से उससे कट आउट कैंसिल आउट फोर के माइनस ट्वेल्व ओके एंड इट बी केम्स फोर के माइनस ट्वेल्व माइनस इयर इज टू के माइनस ट्वेल्व ओके दिस बी केम्स कैंसिल आउट सो इट बी केम्स के माइनस ट्वेल्व एंड फोर के के माइनस ट्वेल्व ओके सो दिस बी केम्स क्वेश्चन दैट के माइनस ट्वेल्व फोर माइनस के माइनस ट्वेल्व फोर के फोर्टी एट के एंड एट एट दिस वी कैम्स वी गट हिस्स फोर्टी एट एंड एट फिफ्टी सिक्स फोर के के माइनस ट्वेल्व एंड इट कन्वर्ट इन टू वी विल कन्वर्ट हिस्स फोर के माइनस फिफ्टी सिक्स फोर के माइनस फिफ्टी सिक्स ओके दिस वी कैम्स सो राइट हियर्स फोर के माइनस ट्वेल्व एंड दिस ए सो डी इज कल टू जीरो सो वी कैन से फोर के माइनस ट्वेल्व सो इज कल टू जीरो सो के इज कल टू ट्वेल्व सो वी विल सॉल्व हियर दिस क्वेश्चन फोर के माइनस ट्वेल्व एंड फोर के माइनस फिफ्टी सिक्स वॉट इज सो इट वी कैम्स फोर के माइनस ट्वेल्व एंड फोर के माइनस ट्वेंटी सिक्स है सो इफ के इज कल टू जीरो Twelve years in the four K is equal to fifty six. Then K is equal to fifty six by four fourteen. Okay, twelve and fourteen. So K we have to answer K is given here. So if K does not exist, K is equal to twelve. That does not satisfy the equations. So. Fourteen will be will be our existence value, real value. So twelve and fourteen are two value. Twelve and fourteen are two value of the questions. Okay, but twelve does not satisfy these questions. So. 14 will be the real value of this equation this is the solution of the given questions okay thank you very much for coming on channel so once again i am mean, telling you that don't forget to share subscribe my channel so that you cannot miss our video okay thank you bye bye